And the teams are coming out here now at the EBB, where it has been raining, but uh, delighted to say it, at this point at least, the uh, rain has abated and we've got a, a little bit of sunshine on the EBB surface. And, uh, in fact, it might be navy blue shorts, sorry. A uh, very, very deep navy blue uh, and uh, a lighter blue, a mid-blue, navy blue shorts and navy blue socks. Teams just shaking hands right now. For the shots, Van Stapscher in goal, Harfield, Minoga and Rowe, the centre-backs, Glover, the left wing-back, Jones, the captain and right wing-back, Willard and Whitbington in midfield, and Josh Stokes behind, Lauren Talaja, Jack Farrow, the evergreen Nicky Featherstone holding the midfield, Tom Crawford and Aggie Mang, who's the one change today for Hartlepool in the central midfield behind Manny Dizarue and Joe Gray up top. The shot's kicking towards the East Bank end in the first half and Haji Minoga back in the side has uh, found Featherstone with his pass forward and now Zach Johnson. And uh, all the shot meanwhile are back underway. Minoga in possession, it's being chased down by Gray. Manages to find a pass across to Ollie Harfield. He's making ground into the pool's half now. Out wide to Glover. Glover with a cross coming in. And it's an own goal, but it's offside. OK, so the ball's ended up in the net. I think it came off the head of a Hartlepool player. And uh, the assistant referee on the near side, Steve, put his flag up straight away. Now, um, interestingly, if it did go in off the head of a pool's player, is that the right decision? Here's Haji Minoga lifting a ball into the right channel for Jack Barham to chase. Um, and uh, on this occasion, he's done well. He's won it. He's in the right-hand side of the penalty. He squares it back. Oh, and it's cut out. But all, one back by Talad. Stokes has got it. Gets the shot in. Deflected wide. Behind for a corner. He's come on in the middle of that... Uh, Defence as well is Dizarube outwitted on this occasion by Haji Minoga, but his ball forward takes a deflection. Is cut out by Ferguson. Dizarube again. Is he going to try a shot from the edge of the area? He is, and it's saved and held by Jordi van Staffelshire. Brush the shot's foot. What source? Um, nobody complained, so it's my eyesight. We'll blame it on that. Gray into the edge of the penalty area to Agimang. He's going to try and get a shot away. That's well blocked. It loops up viciously. And Jordi van Stappershoff, who couldn't be sure if it was on target or not, just manages to palm it behind for a corner. We could see, Steve, that it was going wide anyway, but he didn't know that. Well, very nearly makes contact with the player. Meanwhile, it's been picked up by Joe Gray. No foul given as Jones unloads Gray. Tries a shot from distance. What a strike! It's over the bar, tipped over by Pete Jamieson, but it absolutely sizzled towards goal from the shot's captain. To Willard. Willard squares it out to Harfield. He should be able to get across in now, is he? Um, no, he exchanges passes with Glover. Can Glover work another ball in? Oh, lovely ball on the angle, find Stokes. Stokes squares it. Ping pong between two Hartlepool players and then they clear it. And uh, the ball comes into the box, cleared away by Harfield. Here uh, we'll find Stokes. Stokes plays the ball to Tolad. You could go one on one against Lacey. He's had a heavy touch, but it's come back to him. And he gets his shot away and it's palmed wide by Jamieson. Corner to the shots. And they've started the second half as they finished the first one. So if that result or that score like, oh, there's a ball bouncing. And uh, Gray picks it up inside the penalty area, tries to get it back onto his right foot, comes back inside, touches it to a player, shot comes in, and I think it was going in, Van Stappershoff tips it over the bar, the shot came in from Hendry in the 57th minute, Steve, and Hartlepool go the closest they've been all game. Yep, Featherstone with a right-footed in-swinging corner to the near post, headed away, half away, Spectac spectacular effort comes in from Di Sarouwe, it looks soft, but Van Stappershoof didn't see it at all. He didn't even make an attempt to dive for it. And he's crept in the corner. And we said he was the danger. And he's produced in the 58th minute. Overhead kick from Manny Di Sarouwe. All the shot town nil. Hartley pull one. The shots change it. Willard's given it away. And Hartley Paul can counter here with Gray. And uh, 
On the left hand side, one and one against Haji Minoga. Shot comes in. It's saved by the foot of Jordi Van Stappershaw. Rochdale 2, Oldham 4 now. Corner to the shots, half field. In it comes. Minoga's up, half cleared. Back inside. And then snaffled up in the air from Jamieson. 25 yards. He's more likely to aim for the head of Rowe and uh, Thomas. In it comes. Oh, Minoga got his shot, away, his header away. It was going in at the foot of the post. And Jamieson to the rescue again. Manages to bundle it away for another corner. Cleared away by the keeper off the head of another player. Recycled, half field with another cross. And just as the keeper's going to claim it, it's headed away by Onorisa. And Harfield might just get out of here. No, Harfield's won it back again. He's in the edge of the penalty. Sends it in. And it's in. It's bundled in. And it's Kwame Thomas again, I believe, who's just got there in front of Josh Stokes. Kwame Thomas at the East Bank end. Shots one, who's one. Yeah. Thomas has been given the goal. Excellent delivery from uh, Ollie Harfield, and there was Thomas sliding in. And now the shots are pushing for a winner. Shots are breaking through again here with Josh Stokes. And it scores again. Two goals in a minute for the shots. Tommy Widrington is delirious on the top side. Josh Stokes with his eighth goal of the season. Two goals in a minute. Aldershot Town 2. to the right hand side to Seaman whistles in my ear from everywhere but they're all from the crowd Seaman up against Frost touches it back Cross comes in it's deep to the far post headed back in the air under the bar is caught by Van Staffordshire he does what any goalkeeper would do in this situation falls to the ground he can't overly delay the restart though because the referee will punish him for that we've now had 90 plus 8 minutes and surely when Van Stappershoef kicks from his hand, referee Kirsty Dowell will bring this one to an end. She does! Aldershot Town 2, Hartlepool 1. A come from behind win for the shots. And it's happy days here for the Red and Blue Army at the EBB.